We will start by singing our hello song and then I'll go over all of the names that I see. Hello friends, hello friends, hello friends, we're glad you're here today. All right, in the chat I see two friends have already put in here. Hi, Teacher Emily, my nickname is Kai Mook. Good afternoon, Kai Mook. Good afternoon, teacher. And hi, Teacher Emily, my nickname is Earth. Good afternoon, Earth. <laughs> and who else do I see? I see Nene. I see... Good afternoon, teacher. <laughs> hi, Nene. I see a lot of people, but I don't recognize anyone's names because they're not in English. Can we take a moment to change our names to English so I can recognize you and start to get to know you better? Hi, my name is Fino. Hello, Fino. Hello, Disha. Can we change our names to English names so I can read them and so I can say hello to you? เรียนค่ะใส่ชื่อเล่นภาษาอังกฤษลงไปให้ด้วยค่ะทุกคนเลยแล้วก็รบกวนเปิดกล้องกันด้วยนะคะรบกวนเด็กๆเปิดเปิ
the vocab. Okay, we're gonna go over the vocab. And then we're gonna go over our song and then we'll do our grammar pass and we'll finish our worksheets, okay? Universe. Universe. Solar system. System. Planet. Mercury. Mercury. Neptune. Jupiter. Jupiter. Saturn. Earth. Vocabulary. 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 Okay. That was awesome. A quick review of our vocabulary. And then we're going to listen to our song. We already have done it, but it's just a review. Okay, it's always it's always helpful to review. Unit five. Follow along, Lessons please. one and two. Off we go. our review. Now we're going to go over to our grammar pass. Okay. This first sentence. Who can read the first sentence on the grammar pass for the class? Who wants to be brave? and read this first sentence. The nearest planet to the sun is Mercury. The nearest planet. The nearest planet to the sun. To the sun is Mercury. Is Mercury. Very good job, Nene. The nearest planet to the sun is Mercury. Fantastic job. Thank you for being brave. Number two, the second sentence. Who wants to try to read that one out loud? ประโยคที่สองเป็นใครดียกมือค่ะนัชพล 
นัชพลแก่นซาบครับชื่อเล่นชื่ออะไรนะลูกชื่อฟิโนครับฟิโนใช่ปะครับครับฟิโนอ่านประโยคที่สองกับพิซซ่าจังกวาหน่อยเร็ว The largest planet The largest planet is Jupiter is Jupiter Very good job The largest planet is Jupiter Great job And it's okay to need help. It's okay to ask for help. It's okay to try and get it wrong. Okay, what's not okay is not trying at all. Okay, so when we want to compare more than two things, we put est at the end of our adjective, and it tells us that. That noun is the most of whatever it is, compared to all other nouns in that subject. So we we add est to an adjective to indicate that. Noun is the most compared to all other nouns. Okay, we add est to an adjective to indicate to tell us that a noun is the most compared to all other nouns. Okay, so we have e s T equals EST equals what? What does it tell us? I need you guys to participate. When we add EST, it's right there in the chat. When we add est, it indicates or it tells us that a noun is what? นักเรียนเมื่อคำ adjective ของเราเนี่ยมันใส่ est ลงไปใช่ไหมคะมันจะกลายเป็นอะไรคะในภาษาไทยเนี่ยในภาษาไทยเราเรียกว่าขั้นสูงสุดแต่ในภาษาอังกฤษเราเรียกว่า the most เราเรียนตอบพร้อมกันค่ะ the most the most very good it means it's the most because we're comparing many nouns okay so I'll put that in the chat as well when we add er means comparing two nouns EST means comparing more than two nouns. Okay, so we're comparing one noun to all others. So when we say the nearest planet to the sun is Mercury, there's no planet that's any nearer. Out of all eight planets, Mercury is the nearest planet to the sun. When we say that the largest planet is Jupiter, there's nothing larger. Out of all eight planets, Jupiter is the largest. Okay. So when we go down here, that's exactly what they're asking us. Are these sentences comparing two planets or many planets? Okay, sir. When we use EST, is it? มันเป็นการเปรียบเทียบระหว่างอะไรระหว่างสิ่งสองสิ่งหรือหลายๆสิ่ง Many planets สิ่งสองสิ่ง Very good Yes Many planets We're comparing Mercury to all the others It's the nearest planet to the sun We're comparing Jupiter to all of the others It's the largest planet in the solar system So at the end of an adjective 
to compare it against, to compare a noun against all other nouns, we need to add EST or ER. What do we add? What do you see that they added to these two adjectives? EST or ER? EST. EST. E Great job, Nana. Yes, EST. Woo. Okay. So now what I would like you to do is I would like you to write this, write the grammar pass. Okay. I'm going to put in the chat exactly what I want you to write. Today's date is Friday, November 12th, 2021. We're on unit five, lesson two, the grammar pass. First sentence is the nearest planet to the sun is Mercury. Second sentence is the largest planet is Jupiter. And I want you to write that EST, we're going to add EST to an adjective to compare a noun to all other I want you to write the grammar pass in your notebook. So you should have your pencil, you should have your notebook at the beginning of class always. And I would like us to write the grammar pass. Okay, if you need to look at the group at the chat, that's okay. I also have it on the screen. Okay, I want you to write these two sentences right here. The nearest planet to the sun is Mercury. The largest planet is Jupiter. You guys are doing really good. We only have, we have about halfway through, okay? The more you participate, the more fun we have, the more we learn, okay? Nice job, I see. Um, yes, you raised your hand. What's up? I no, I'm going to repeat. Hmm. Who I'm going to repeat? I'm going to repeat. Uh, he said, uh, Miss Taken, Miss Taken, he pressed the the wrong. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> That's okay. If you have a question, feel free to raise your hand or just ask. If you have a cool comment that you want to share i'm all ears truly the more you guys talk the more fun this class will be i know it can be a little bit nerve-wracking to be speaking a different language it's not easy but just be brave and be kind and we'll have a great class okay Make sure you're writing. If you're not, if your video is not on, I still expect you to be paying attention and to be following along. When you finish writing these two sentences, give me a thumbs up. When you finish writing these two sentences, give me a thumbs up. Mr. Friend that is eating, have you written these sentences? Have you written these sentences? If you are eating, that tells me that you've already written the sentences, so they should be done. Can we move on? 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 Can we move on?
เด็กๆมีใครไม่เข้าใจไหมคะคือฟังแล้วไม่เข้าใจอ l right, we're gonna move on. Okay. So, did we already finish page 17 as a class? Yes or no? Did we already finish page 17? n e n e did we already finish page 17 last class? ทางนี้แล้วของทั้งสองเราทำไปแล้วใช่ไหมใช่ครับข้างบนข้างล่างเลยใช่ไหมลูกใช่ค่ะโอเค finish already ค่ะทิเชอร์อ awesome let's go on to our second one okay we did not do this one yet have we we did not finish this one yet right Not finished. Not finished. Okay, so we're gonna go over it. We're gonna do it all. Okay, so just like the grammar pass, they want us to create sentences with adjectives that not only describe but also compare certain nouns to all other nouns. So we have four words up on the top. What is this word? The highlighted yellow word. What's that word? Can I learn? Do ค่ะในกรอบสี่เหลี่ยมสี่คำที่เขาให้มามีคำว่าอะไรบ้างลูกหนูบอกทีเชอร์เลยค่ะ What word is this? คำแรกอ่านว่าอะไรคะ L A R G E large ถูกต้องค่ะ large means big okay what's the second word in the word box มันอ่านว่า cold หรือ cold cold very good cold the third word in our word box is it's a tricky one hig not hig hi High, it means tall. High, I know it's a really weird word. The G is silent. High means tall. And the last word in our word box is near. Near, great job. So they want us to take the adjective and add est to compare nouns. Right, so we need to add e s t to the end. So for the first sentence, okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna open it up and I can actually type. Okay, so for the first sentence, blank mountain in the world is Mount Everest. Look at the four adjectives and think about which one plus e s t. Describes and compares Mount Everest to all other mountains on Earth. Which adjective are we going to put in here? I'm going to look at. We have four words, right? Flash, coal, high, near. ทีนี้เราต้องเอาไอ้สี่คำเนี้ยมาอยู่ในรูปของ superlative form ก็คือการเติม est ใช่ไหมคะถูกไหมคะเด็กๆถูกไหมลูกถูกเนาะทีนี้หนูดูข้อที่หนึ่ง mountain ภูเขาเนี่ยภูเขาเนี่ยนะคะที่ที่สุดในโลกเนี่ยเราเรียกว่าพวกเขา Everest ถูกปะนั้นเราต้องเอาคำอะไรเติมลงไป Everest มันอะไรที่สุดในโลกสูงที่สุดใช่ถ้าเป็นสูงที่สุดหนูก็ดูว่าสี่คำนั้นอะคำไหนที่แปลว่าสูงเ
Hi. 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 Great job. Hi. And what do we add at the end of hi to make it a superlative adjective? Hi. And hi, like hi, the BST of the what I have. Hi. Highest. The highest. The highest mountain in the world is Mount Everest. There is no mountain any higher than Mount Everest. Mount Everest is the highest mountain in the world. Great job. Fill in the blank with the highest. All right, number two. Blank ocean in the world is the Pacific Ocean. Hmm, which adjective can we use to describe and compare the Pacific Ocean to all other oceans in the world? Alaska. The largest, great job, Nene. She gave me the superlative adjective, the largest. ocean in the world is the Pacific Ocean. Go ahead and write the largest in number two's blank. We're doing really good guys. We're a little more than halfway. We got 20 more minutes, okay? Keep working really hard. The harder you work, the easier this will get. Cool. Nine, you already gave me the word for three. Perfect. So three says blank place on earth is Antarctica. And nine said we should use the adjective cold. Who can help nine? How do we make that adjective a superlative adjective to compare Antarctica to all other places on earth? Coldest. The coldest place on earth is Antarctica. Very good. I love the teamwork. Okay. Fill in the third blank with the coldest. The coldest. Nearest. Nearest. Nene, good job. Number four, she said that it should be nearest. The nearest star to the earth is the sun. So we're comparing the, star, the sun to all other stars. The nearest star to the earth is the sun. We're comparing the sun to all other stars. Great job. Make sure your blanks are all filled in. Give me a thumbs up when you're ready to go to number two. Give me a thumbs up when you're ready to go to number two. Anyone ready? I should see thumbs up if you're ready. I'm looking for thumbs up. I'm looking for thumbs up to tell me that you're ready to move on. Okay, 
มันทําในเวิร์กชีตถูกไหมเด็กๆมันทําในเวิร์กชีตนะหนูไม่น่าเฉยเฉยนะอ่ะเมื่อหนูทําเสร็จแล้วให้หนูทําสัญลักษณ์เครื่องหมายยกนิ้วขึ้นให้ทีเชอร์เขารับทราบเลยค่ะว่าเราเสร็จแล้วเย่ไอ้ก้าวตามซับ from one friend what's your name in the yellow shirt remind me yellow shirt n i n e yes nine awesome nine good job nine all right we're gonna we're gonna move on because we got to keep going all right We are on the bottom right here. Now we're going to make our own sentences. We're going to make our own sentences. So they give us a planet, and they give us an adjective, and they want us to make a superlative sentence using that adjective to describe and to compare the planet. The first one, which planet do they give us? เรียนดูสิข้อที่หนึ่งเขาให้ sorry เขาให้คำศัพท์อะไรหนูมา planet ที่เขาให้มาคือคำว่าอะไรคะ earth 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 and what's the adjective that they give us What's this word in the middle? What's the adjective that they give us to describe Earth? Adjective ก็คือคำคุณศัพท์คือคำว่าอะไรคะขึ้นต้นด้วยตัว G ลูก Green. Green. Now, how are we going to describe and compare Earth to all other planets using the adjective green? Make it a superlative sentence. Who can give me the sentence? เนเน่ได้ไหมแต่งประโยคนี้ให้ทีเชอร์หน่อยถ้าเราจะให้มันเป็นในให้ประโยคเนี่ยมันอยู่ในรูปของ superlative forms ใช่ไหมลูกเราต้องเขียนยังไง earth earth is the greenest planet อะไรเด็กตอบทีเชอร์ค่ะเด็กตอบทีเชอร์ค่ะ earth is Earth is, Earth is the greenest. The greenest planet. Very good. Earth is the greenest planet. Out of all eight planets, Earth is the greenest. Very good. Write that sentence down on your worksheet, please. เขียนลงไปในเวิร์กชีตเลยค่ะแล้วเรียนเขียนลงไปในเวิร์กชีตเลยนะคะทุกคนทำพร้อมกันนะคะกราบจ้า I see so many friends with their pencils writing in their worksheets Earth is the greenest planet. If your video is off, I expect that you are following along and filling out your worksheet. Getting your worksheets done is going to be a big part of your grade. So, may I go to the toilet? Uh huh. What did you say, nine? May I go to the toilet? Oh, of course, Nine. Go right ahead. Thank you for asking so sweetly and in English. I loved it. Go right ahead. Thank you. <laughs> of course. Awesome. We're gonna go to number two. It says we have a planet and we have an adjective. What is the first word? What's that planet? k a i m u k what's that planet in number two? k a 
I move Grace. Let's see who else I have in my list on the chat. Let me see. Um, August, Folk, Achieve, Earth. Someone, please tell me what planet did they want us to talk about in number two? Jupiter, and what is the adjective that they want us to use to describe Jupiter? What's the adjective in the middle? Now, how are we going to make that into a superlative sentence? Who can tell me the sentence? That would be Jupiter is the largest planet. Very good. Jupiter is the largest planet. Now notice we don't need to put EST at the end. We just put ST because large already has an E at the end. Mm -hmm. Nice job, Nene. Man, Nene and Nine are rocking it. I've heard them more than anybody today and I'm so proud. All right, anybody can help me with number three. They give us a planet and an adjective. What planet do they give us? Neptune. Neptune, great job. And what is the adjective? Cold. 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 So how can we change Neptune and cold to make a superlative sentence. What's going to be our sentence? I'm going to try to call on some friends. Let me see who I can call on. Um, Fino, Achi, Crete, August, Party, Jello, Ten. Lots of you are here. I'd like for you to participate. Can someone tell me the sentence that we're going to write? ข้อสองเขียนลงไปก่อนนะคะทำข้อสองลงไปก่อนนะคะลูกโอ้ one student type in the chat box Perfect. Let me see. Sometimes it doesn't let me open it up really easily. <laughs> awesome. Neptune is the coldest planet. Yes, thank you, Nine, for helping your teammates and your classmates out. Oops. Neptune. Oh, I want it. Neptune is the coldest planet. Neptune is the coldest planet. All right, let's read these. All right, let's read these sentences out loud. Earth is the greenest planet. Your turn. Earth is the greenest planet. Your turn. 
Perfect. Jupiter is the largest planet. Jupiter is the largest planet. planet. Very good. Neptune is the coldest planet. Neptune, Neptune is the coldest planet. planet. Very good. Very good. Okay. Get that. So your whole worksheet should be done. Okay, if you didn't finish it, then you have to do that on your own, okay? I'm gonna play a little video. I think we might have already watched this one, but it's a really great little video. Um, about the planets. Okay, let me share my screen again. All right, listen and follow along. Hopefully it loads. Mercury, Venus, Earth, Mars, Jupiter, Saturn, Uranus, Neptune, Mercury, Venus, Earth, Mars, Jupiter, is the blank planet to the sun. What are they saying here? Mercury is the blank planet to the sun. Marianne, Mercury is the closest. Closest ในที่นี้หมายถึงอยู่ใกล้ที่สุดลูกใกล้ที่สุด Mercury ก็คือดาวเคราะห์ที่อยู่ใกล้ดวงอาทิตย์ที่สุด closest เห็นไหมคะเป็น adjective Mercury is the closest เราเรียกเอาเสียงตามค่ะ closest 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 it's the same closest means the same thing as nearest closest nearest Closest, nearest. They're the exact same thing. Venus comes next. It's the hottest. Venus comes next. It's the Venus. <coughs> Venus. You lost it. Lost it. Right? The. What? Huh? Let's learn the adjective. Let's use it. The. What? Hottest. The hottest. The hottest. The hottest. 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 Hot hottest. Means like the same thing as warm or like boiling, right? Hottest one. One. Earth 
Mars has the blank canyon and volcano. Mars has the blank canyon and volcano. That's good. The largest, very wow. good. Mars has the largest, which means big. The largest canyon and volcano. Almost done guys, one more minute. Gassy planet Jupiter, the blank you will find. Last bit. Great job, Nene. The largest you will find. And Saturn has rings around the outside. Saturn has rings around where? Outside. The outside, very good. It's not a superlative adjective, but it's a pretty cool fact. Uranus is funny because it spins on its side. Uranus is funny because it spins on its side. side. Again, not a superlative adjective, but a pretty cool fact. Looks the coldest of its kind. Neptune looks blue, the blank of its kind. Crosses. Coldest. Very good. Coldest. Coldest. Okay. All right. That was great. Thank you to the few friends that were really, really participating in this class. I really appreciate it. Um, like I said, the more you participate, the more you'll learn and the more fun we can have, okay? So for the next class, we meet again next Thursday. Nine, do you want to pick a song for the next class, buddy? No, no. น้องแม่ขอหนึ่งเพลงเพลงช้างเหรอครูช้างหมดเลยลูกเพลงช้างก็ได้ครับเพลงช้างนะครับโอเคเดี๋ยวพี่ช่อส่งให้พี่ช่